Wow, Halloween can certainly be a scary time of year. There's lots of tricks and treats and goblins out there, but the most scariest thing for the Office of the Sheriff and my staff, and especially our community, are those persons out there that are lurking about that are wanted. This year, Queen Anne's County's Most Wanted Halloween Special Edition. Daniel Anthony Vernot, born on October 22nd, 1972. You have a warrant for a violation of probation for a charge of a driving while impaired. The warrant was issued on May 1st also for a fail to appear on the original charge of an assault. Your last known address that we have on file was Chestertown or Wharton. We're asking our viewers out there, send us the anonymous tip so we can get Daniel Anthony Vernot held accountable for his charges. This guy here needs to be taken off the street. This is one of those people that we don't want lurking around, especially during Halloween or any time of the year. Raul Gonzalez, born on January 20th, 1956. He's a Hispanic male. He has a warrant issued for failing to appear as a registered sex offender. This guy has an address last known of Crumpton or Chestertown. Our public, we need your help. This guy needs to be off the street. This guy here, he's been out there. This guy here beats to a different drum. James Lewis Helsel. He was born on October 20th, 1969. He has a warrant issued on April the 13th, 2007 for failing to appear for a criminal jury trial. This guy's last known address is Elkton. But hopefully we'll have some information soon about what stage, what area this guy plays on. Erica Fitzgerald. She was born on November the 17th, 1976. She has a warrant issued on November the 4th, 2004 for a violation of probation on a controlled dangerous substance charge, not marijuana. This person has a last known address in Baltimore or possibly now New York. To all of our detectives out there on Facebook, help us out here. Get us some anonymous tips on her social media profiles. Tiffany Renee Frost. Born on October the 24th, 1986. She has a warrant issued in December 10th of 2009 for failing to appear on the original charge of an assault. To our viewers, we have no information on this person. If you know her or if you know of her or have any information at all, your tip will be very valuable in the apprehension of Tiffany. As always, Halloween's a pretty scary time of year. But like I said, it's even more scarier to know that these persons are out there and are not being held accountable for the things that they're accused of. Most community members do the right thing. They turn themselves in when they have a warrant. We need our community to help us send us those tips and let's make sure that these bad persons are off the street. Again, we hope everybody has a safe and happy Halloween. Let's keep our children safe. Most importantly though, Thanks to our viewers out there for all the tips and all the information that you provide us on a weekly basis. Queen Anne's County is one of the safest places on the shore, and we appreciate that due to you. Special thanks to Queen Anne's County TV7, our Queen Anne's County Commissioners, and all the staff for bringing this to you. Again, you can send us an anonymous tip, and here it is. You can either send a tip through our app, and those tips are anonymous. You can also send a tip through our Facebook Messenger. You can also call our tip line at 410-758-6666.